Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my friend, but I can upgrade god mobs to super god mobs. Basically, how this works is I can spawn in any god mob I want and bring it through this super god machine to turn it into its super god variant. And this is gonna allow me to create some insane mobs. So anyways, Cordy, are you ready for the first round of the mob battle? Yes, Smirky, I am. Let's go. Let's go. And now that the mob battle has officially started let me show you exactly how this is gonna work so as you see right here we have our super god machine and basically what this is gonna allow us to do is bring any mob into this portal and once it goes into the portal it will go on to the other side and turn it into its super god variant over here but this is not the only thing that we are gonna be using during this mob battle oh no no over here we also have this button that can turn this bedrock wall to turn the wall well, it's a glass, but this isn't any normal glass. This is literally one-way glass, which means right now, Cardi is literally staring at a bedrock wall. But the reason why we have this glass set up is so we can actually see what kind of mobs Cardi is spawning in. And would you look at that? Cardi is already getting to spawning in his mobs. And for what it, and what it looks like is this round, he is literally spawning in this wither symbiote zombie. And did you just see that thing slam attack that was actually kind of crazy but uh as you saw it's crazy attack that means that this mob is really really strong which is a good thing that we have this super god machine because we can make literally any mob we want and have it destroy basically anything so to start off why don't we literally spawn in a god mob but to spawn in the normal god mob what we gotta do is first get the original variant of the mob we want to spawn in and something that i think could completely destroy this and it's normal normal variant is actually a wither and let's build that really quick so to spawn in this wither we actually need to build it first just like that and there we go now we have a wither and this is gonna be super duper powerful normally how it is since this is the normal most strong boss in vanilla which means it is really really good but to make this thing into its god variant we gotta get this god potion just like the normal god minecraft mob battles and throw it onto this guy and what what on earth did this mob turn into? Does this god wither literally have a command block? Okay, this is just the first god variant of this mob, which means that this is gonna get way better once we actually bring this through this portal over here. So, uh, Mr. Witherstorm, I guess we gotta bring you through that portal. So, what we're gonna do to bring this guy through the portal is get this guy on a chain and bring it all the way over here and get ready to go through the portal. And I kind of wonder what happens if this god mob actually goes through this portal i wonder if it's gonna upgrade or downgrade well i mean it should turn into a super god but you know what let's see what happens when we bring it through the portal let's go and what on earth did this turn into what am i hearing what on earth is that this literally the first super god variant well i guess that makes sense i guess we did end up spawning a literal baby with store first so it only makes sense that it turned into this giant version but compared to cardi's mob all the way over here that kind of looks a little bit puny compared to this so this should mean that this mob is really really good but now our army is ready and what this mob should do once we drop the walls is to literally start sucking up cardi's mob and just kill it instantly with its giant team if you can see those up there if you think this mob is cool remember to hit the subscribe button because like none of you are subscribed anyways let's ask cordy if he is ready to drop the wall so he goes to the first round of the mob battle so cordy are you ready to go to the first round of the mob battle of course i am smoke this is gonna be the easiest win ever all right cordy well if you think it's gonna be the easiest win ever cordy i'm just gonna let you know in advance that uh you are probably wrong about that and if you see those giant giant spotlights on your arena that should give you a little bit of a hint about what I spawned in. Yeah, I don't even know what those are, Smokey, but it's probably a super weak mob. Uh, anyways, Cardi, are you sure about that? Yes, I am, Smokey. Are you ready to drop the walls? Yes, Cardi, I am. And you know what? Let's drop them in three, two, one. And let's go, Cardi. The mob battle has now started. Wait. And Cardi, look at what's happening to your mob. What on earth is going on? What it is it getting sucked up? by these spotlights? Yes, Cordy, it is. And remember what I said at the beginning? 
Your mom is literally gonna have to watch out for my spotlights and wait, Cardi, there's no way it just instantly died. Where did it go? I just saw it get eaten by its giant mouth and it's just chewing right now. What is going on? Look at the top of the screen. All of its health is gone. I definitely lost Sparky. Yeah. And what is happening right above it, Cardi? Wait, what is this thing right here? It just dropped an enchanted command block, look, Cardi. What the heck even is that, Smirky? How did you spawn such a powerful mob? Um, Cardi, I have no idea how I spawned this in. Well, anyways, Cardi, that must have been literally one of the fastest mob rounds ever. And wasn't your mob supposed to be really, really strong? Yes, it was, Smirky, but I didn't know you spawned a mob a thousand times better. Or, uh, yeah, Cardi, well, I obviously did. I guess you could say this mob was a super god. Anyways, are you ready to just reset the arena? Yes, I am. Let's go. Let's go. And as you saw, that first round was literally insane. And I guess this machine is literally doing its work because with this, we should be able to literally kill all of Cardi's mobs super duper quickly, which means that these super god mobs are actually just insane. But remember that we are going to be making some of the most insane super god mobs later. So do not leave. And to start things off, why on earth did we get this command block book? This is literally something that Cardi's mobs dropped when it died. Well, I have an idea. I feel like we could actually use this to make a really, really strong mob. So you know what? Why don't we actually get onto that? So let's grab this book and figure out what kind of mob we should spawn in with this. And I feel like this book is going to give our mob some really good power. So we got to figure out something that can hold this book, actually. And I might actually have a pretty good idea of what that mob is. So let's spawn it in. And that mob is a wandering night leader. And there is a really, really really specific reason why I'm spawning this mob in and it's not because this guy is really strong like as you can see I was literally just hitting it with my diamond sword and it wasn't doing like any damage but there is a different reason why I spawned in this mob it's because if we get an item called the armor editor and actually right click it we can get rid of its armor and make it so that we can customize whatever armor this guy is having we are able to upgrade this mob in whatever way we want and why don't we just play around with this and see what we can do so the first upgrade I want to do to this mob to make it into its god variant is I actually want to start by giving it these command block stuff. So let's put a command block on its head and also give it that command block book and look at this guy. He looks so weird right now. Well, this should be pretty interesting because now it should be able to have some really, really cool command block powers. And this is already slightly turning into its god variant. But how else can we make it into its god variant? Well, we probably should give it some really good armor too so why don't we get onto that so what i'm gonna grab is some random armor like some turtle armor and some turtle boots and then even some turtle leggings and why don't we give it this armor like that and now this guy has some turtle armor and uh don't ask me why i gave it turtle armor it's kind of weird but now we got another upgrade to do with this mob and let me show you what we're gonna do so we are gonna get a bedrock sword because this is literally one of the most strong weapons in the game and then we are gonna give it to this mob to complete all of its armor and look how insane our mob looks now he literally has some of the coolest armor and weapons in the game but now i feel like we upgraded that normal mob into its god variant just by giving it some really cool but now you know the drill we gotta bring it through this portal but before we do that i feel like we should kind of see what cardi is spawning in just to make sure that this mob will actually be able to kill it so why don't we just press this button to turn the wall into glass and what on earth is that that is literally a mecha godzilla if you don't know what this mob is this is literally probably the most 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 powerful robot mod there is in minecraft and it is a good thing that we spawned the mod we did because let me explain why basically our mob has command blocks which should mean that our mob can do whatever it wants to it but i feel like once we make it into its super god variant it will upgrade it into a more insane mob so you know what since we already figured out what cardi's mob is why don't we just us, get this guy on the chain and then bring him over to the super god portal and hopefully you do turn into something way better than that mecha godzilla so you know what get up on this ramp we are bringing you through the portal mr mob and you know what let's go and look at what our mob spawned in wait is that hero brian what on earth spawned in is this the super god variant of the mob that we spawned in wait i'm a little bit confused why this is the super god variant but let's figure out why so i guess we did start off by spawning in that really strong soldier which should 
think that that is the really strong soldier and it even has the bedrock sword that we gave it so that makes a little bit of sense but why on earth is it hero brian i guess it did turn into a really strong mob but wait there's the command block we gave our mob in wait is this supposed to be like the muted thing with turtle armor wait that's actually kind of crazy and this is literally what the hero brian is sitting on and riding which means that this guy is super duper powerful and can be controlled by literally hero brian himself though that's kind of insane but i wonder what cool powers this mob has i mean i guess we'll just have to figure out in the battlefield so in that case let's figure out if cardi's actually ready for the mob battle and cardi are you ready for the mob battle marky yes i am but i have a way more powerful mob this time cardi are you sure you have a way more powerful mob this time the last round your mob got killed instantly that's all i'm gonna say to you okay i know that smoky and that's why i spotted one of the best bosses ever the best bosses ever cardi i literally hear robot clinking noises on your side are you sure you spotted one of the best mobs ever yes you are just gonna have to wait and see um okay cardi you know it in that case why don't we just drop the walls right now and let's go cardi the mob battle is officially starting and it looks like your mob is starting to take a lot of damage but uh that is not good so is my mob Marky, what is happening do you see all this crazy stuff there's a bunch of explosions yeah there is cardi and look at what my mob is doing it's literally destroying the entire arena and doing so much damage to your mob but wait cardi there is a lot of lightning raining down is that doing a lot more damage to your mob than my mob yes i think so because i have a robot mob and its biggest weakness is electricity and cardi wait your mob just sealed i wonder what is happening but my mobs are still doing so much damage to your mob this is so crazy sparky how is this happening but wait cardi i think your mom's starting to electrocute what is going on wait this is really bad it's taking a bunch of damage now and wait what is going on i don't know it's it's all getting sent to lightning now and it it, it kind of just disappeared cardi where did it go smoky it did not disappear it just died i just lost the mob battle there is no way you lost, Cordy. Uh, I, where did my hero Brian go? Because I spawned that mob in too. I think that died too, Smirky. Uh, yeah, that's really weird. But Smirky, why is there a giant command block on your mob? That is insane. Uh, Cordy, I think I just spawned a really good mob like last round. And I guess that command block was making all that really crazy stuff happen. Oh, I guess that makes sense, Smirky. But anyways, are you ready to go on to the next round? Well, I guess that makes sense, Smirky. But what? is this portal over here? Uh, Cardi, I guess that's one of the really crazy things that spawned from this. Uh, I have no idea what it is. Maybe it's just a decoration. Just ignore it for now, I guess. Okay, that's really weird, Smoky, but I'm ready to go on to the next round. All right, Cardi, we'll make sure next time you don't get super destroyed. And now, we are officially on to the next round of the mob battle, but do not leave because we also have some insane super god mobs to keep spawning in, but remember, that was not a good thing that Cardi saw our portal next last round be because we do want to keep this a secret from him because we do not want him figuring out that we are literally using this to spawn in some really really good mobs so, so hopefully we can keep destroying him and make sure he doesn't see this thing anyways let's just come over here and press this button to see what Cardi is gonna spawn in and it looks like Cardi is literally spawning in a giant snake monster wait what even is this um, what kind of attacks does this guy have because this guy looks really really strong well i mean i guess we're gonna find out because cardi is spawning in villagers to test out his mob and wait is this thing shooting acid at the villagers wait that is actually really really strong and that should start poisoning them and yeah look at that it's literally dying of poison and i think it literally killed all the rest of the villagers what kind of mob is that thing that thing is super duper powerful um okay i feel like i need more of a hint as to what this mob is because this looks really really strong and i feel like we need to figure out a really good counter for this mob before we actually end up spawning anything in so uh let's just try to get some hints from cardi about what his mob actually is because all i know it is is it's an acid snake so cardi um uh i hear some weird noises happening on your side can you tell me what you're spawning in 
Well, Smirky, I'll tell you one thing, and I have a, a giant OP three-headed snake. A giant OP three-headed snake. Gordy, what are you talking about? That sounds really insane, but is it just a giant three-headed OP snake that can spit acid? Because I feel like I know what you're spawning in. Ah, uh, Smirky, uh, uh, yeah, that's kind of exactly what my mom is. How do you know? Ah, uh, Gordy, because you said it was a giant snake, but is there anything else special about your mom? Yes, there is, Smirky, and I'll tell you, every time it loses a head, it literally can grow back, and it grows back with two. Wait, Cordy, are you serious? Wait, so your mom is actually super insane, and it's kind of invincible, is what you're telling me? Yes, it is, Smirky. I just chopped off one of its heads, and it's about to grow back with four. Are you kidding me, Cordy? What the heck are you spawning in? That is not a good thing. Well, Smirky, you're gonna have to try really hard with your mom, because there's no way you're beating my snake. Are you kidding me, Cordy? Okay, well, now I feel like I actually need to spawn in something really good and it's a good thing Cardi can't hear me saying that because we gotta figure out a really really good counter for this mob and I actually have an idea so this thing actually relies on its acid attack so why don't we literally spawn in a king god mod to, to start off with so you know what we're gonna do we are gonna go in the search bar and search up king and uh let's figure out what kind of mobs there are so there's a villager king but we don't really want a villager because villagers are kind of newbie and there's also also a skeleton king. Wait, a skeleton king ca sounds kind of cool, but what is this mob? Uh, is this literally a king skeleton? Wait, this guy looks pretty powerful and he should be able to dodge all of that mob's acid attacks. Since the acid can actually just not burn away its bones, since it literally only gets rid of the flesh of mobs. So this mob actually might be able to counter that mob, but it is still not strong enough to defeat this mob. So I feel like we have something to do. I feel like we gotta turn you into your god variant. So you know what we're gonna do, Mr. Skeleton? We are gonna get the chain and then bring you into the portal to turn you into your god variant. So let's bring you in the portal and let's go! And what on earth spawned in? There's nothing right here. Well, uh, I see a boss bar on my screen and wait, what the heck is this? Wait, is this what I think it is? What kind of mob is this? It says it is a lord skeleton, so I guess it turned into its lord version, which is way better than king. And I guess this is literally the super god variant that came from the machine over there but I wonder what kind of attacks this mob has. Well, I guess we'll figure out. So, you know the drill. What we're gonna do is grab some villager spawn eggs and actually spawn them in down here. So, let's spawn them in and let's see what's gonna happen. And, oh, what just happened? It literally just turned everything into a nuclear thing. Or, wait, is this acid? What on earth just happened? And, and what is my mob doing? Well, I guess it literally had an insane acid attack because it literally just went it destroyed the entirety of my arena. And what just happened? Wait, I think it's even breaking the grass. That is not a good thing because if Cardi actually looks this way, he's gonna see that the wall's broken and it's glass on my side. So we gotta be quick and actually go on to the next round of this mob battle. So Cardi, are you ready to go on to the next round of the mob battle? And Cardi, just let me know quickly. Sparky, yes I am, but I am just admiring my mob because it's so cool. Um, okay, Cardi, well, keep looking at your mobs while I drop the wall and let's drop in right now. Let's go, Cardi. The walls have now dropped. Smirky, oh my gosh, what did you spot in? Cordy, this is literally the Lord Skeleton. It's basically a way better version than the King Skeleton. Oh my gosh, it's basically a giant ghost and this thing looks insane. Yeah, Cordy, I know it looks insane and look at all the attacks it's doing. It's not even taking damage from your mob. Smirky, yeah, how is this thing not taking damage from my crazy snake? Cordy, I have no idea, but it's literally not taking any damage. You're losing any elephant. Wait, it's turning its arena into literally all acid. What is going on, Cardi? This is super bad. My snake's probably getting really, really low on health. Cardi, is it getting really low on health? Because it's literally just regrowing its heads. Yeah, Smirky, but I'm pretty sure once it grows too many heads, it'll die. Uh, are you sure about that, Cardi? I'm pretty sure, Smirky. Yeah, look at this. This is so bad. Uh, yeah. I mean, it is just stuck taking damage while my mom is just sitting back and letting the whole arena turn into its acid. Come on, Mr. Snake. You need to start doing some better attacks. You suck. Uh, Cardi, yeah, I think it does suck. And, Cardi, wait, I think your mom just died without doing any damage. 
destroy my skeleton boss. Oh my gosh, Marky, I don't even know how this happened. Are you kidding me? Cardi, no, I'm not kidding you. And look how destroyed it made the arena. I know, Smirk, you spotted a super insane boss this round. I know, Cardi, but you know, my bosses are only gonna get better, and it doesn't seem like your bosses are getting better at all. Yes, they are, Smirky. My next boss will be even crazier. Cardi, are you sure about that? Yes, I am. All right, then. Well, in that case, let's move on to the next round. And Cardi, remember, next round is literally the final round. So you gotta make sure that you spawn in a really, really, really good mob. I will do that. Let's go. And let's go. Go! We are now on to the final round of the mob battle. And remember, you guys should definitely subscribe because almost none of you guys are subscribed. And that's really weird. So if you enjoyed this video, you should definitely subscribe. And also remember not to leave because we are on to the final round of the mob battle. And as you remember, whenever we're on to the final rounds of the mob battles, that means we are literally going to be trying our hardest to spawn in whatever mobs are really, really good. I actually have a pretty uh, good idea of what kind of mob I want to spawn in for this round. But before I spawn that in, let's actually press the spawn in and see what Cardi's up to like this. And what on earth is Cardi spawn again? This is literally the Void Master. Okay, I'm pretty sure this mob is literally a god mob in itself, but I kind of wonder if we can spawn in a better mob than this. I mean, it will definitely be a challenge, but what on earth is this? This mob just looks insane. Well, I actually do have an idea of what kind of mob I want to spawn in and let's try and figure out how we can make that possible well to start out with we are literally gonna spawn in a tiny armor version of me and i don't know why this guy is so short compared to me but it looks really funny but remember what we did in the second round when we gave our mob some really cool custom armor it basically turned that mob into its armored version so i feel like if we give this guy some really cool armor it will turn into something really cool and it will be even cooler because it's me so i kind of I wonder what we can make this happen. So I kind of wonder what we can make this turn into. So we are going to, of course, grab our armor editor. And then we are also going to grab some really cool black void dragon armor. So let's grab all this armor. And then even grab a giant sword. And let's get rid of this guy's armor since it's just iron armor. And give it all this super cool custom armor. And wait, look how cool this guy looks like this. He actually looks kind of insane. And that it looks amazing. But I don't really want to stop there because we can make this guy even better and let me show you how we're gonna make this better so we are gonna spawn in a normal dinosaur and then come over here and make this guy then also spawn in a dinosaur to make this guy also have a dinosaur companion since these are really really cool so we have my skin with god armor and then we also have a cool dinosaur and normally dinosaurs are really strong so i'm just gonna count this as a god mob but now what we're gonna do is get our chain and then get this guy on our chain so we can bring him out everywhere and then also get this mob on our chain so we can bring him in this portal too and come on mobs let's go in the portal and let's turn you into your super god variants let's go and i wonder what our mob turned into and what on earth is that that is literally a void dinosaur i think okay that looks okay that makes cordy's mob literally look like a block compared to this because this guy is literally just huge and he looks very vicious so I guess what happened is since we also spawned in a dinosaur in my guy in some void dragon armor It literally combined the two into its super god variant and this is just insane And I feel like Cardi can even see this mob peeking through its walls when it moves over there And uh Cardi are you ready to drop the walls? Smirky of course I am ready to drop the walls and win this final round Uh Cardi are you sure you're ready to win this final round because I'm just gonna let you know in advance I don't think you're gonna win Smirky you have no idea what kind of mob I spawned and you are gonna be so surprised. Am I really gonna be super surprised, Cardi? Yes, you are! This thing is a crazy void monster! Um, okay, Cardi. Anyways, let's just drop the walls and see what will happen! Let's go! And let's 
go! The walls are now drop Cardi and prepare to lose. What on earth is this? I thought my mom was good, but yours is massive. Cardi, I mean, your mom isn't even that massive. What is my mom doing, though? It's literally spawning and lightning and turning the arena into wither blocks. Wait, that's actually crazy, Cardi, and I think it's even spawning in my own wither skeletons, and this is just crazy, Cardi. I am not gonna win this. I totally thought I was, though. This void monster's so done for. Yeah, it is. And, Cardi, what on earth just happened? Sparky, my void monster died. Are you kidding me? There is no way that happened, and there is also no way that my mom killed that god mob so fast, Cardi. Sparky, I am so bad, but why do you keep talking about, like, god mobs and stuff? Uh, Cardi, well, I guess now that I've officially won the mob battle, I should let you in on a little bit of a secret that I've had. Wait, what kind of secret did you have? Well, you remember that decoration I was talking about that I said was, uh, just a decoration and for you to not worry about? Yeah, this portal thing, is this some sort of machine? Uh, yeah, you are right about that, Cardi, but it is not any, like, normal machine or anything. This is literally a machine to turn god mobs into their super god variant. What on earth? You had super god mobs? Uh, yeah, that's kind of how my mobs were killing your mobs in, like, one second every single round. Oh my gosh, I'm so mad at you for cheating! What? You're mad? Okay, Cardi, don't be mad. You know what? I'll actually just give you the win if you don't be mad at me. Oh, Smirky, okay, I'll take the win. Let's go! All right, then. Well, if you enjoyed this Cardi and Smirky video, remember to like and subscribe, and remember to click on one of the videos on the screen because it really, really helps out. Bye! Bye!